Hello students, today let us understand how to calculate debt equity ratio and proprietary ratio by using given information. Here in this problem they have given balance sheet and assets and liabilities. So by using this we need to calculate debt equity ratio of the company. So if we want to calculate debt equity ratio the information we require is the long term debts of the company and shareholders fund. We require only liability side information. We don't want any information relating to the assets while calculating debt equity ratio. Debt equity ratio expresses the relationship between the long term debts and shareholders fund. So first we need to find out what are all included in the long term debts. So long term debts includes debenture of the company and any other long term loan which has been borrowed by the company from the external sources it may be secured it may be unsecured but it should be for the long term period in the sense it should be for more than one year that has to be considered while determining long term debts so in the same way we require another information that is shareholders fund so if you want to determine share, shareholders fund you need you need to add equity share capital balance preference share capital balance then general reserve balance then capital reserve balance if any and profit and loss account balance given in the liability side if you add all these information you will get total shareholders fund so in this problem first let us uh, determine the long term debts give you know what are all the long term debts uh, is there in the company so here the company has debenture and the company don't have any other long term loans so long term uh, debts as per this problem will be only 9% debentures so then we need to determine shareholders fund shareholders fund uh, as per this problem is total of equity share capital 10% preference share capital general reserve and profit and loss account and in this problem uh, the company don't have any capital reserve so if you want to calculate debt to equity ratio as i told you before we require long term debts and shareholders fund as per this problem the company has only debenture it don't have any other long term loans so long term debt will be equal to only the uh, only the value of debentures then shareholders fund is preference share capital total equity share capital total then general reserve total and profit and loss account total uh, debenture as per this problem is rupees 1 lakh and preference share capital is 50,000 is given equity share capital is 1 lakh 50,000 is given general reserve is 70,000 and profit and loss account is 30,000 so if you divide debentures and uh, shareholders fund in the sense long term debt and shareholders fund you will get de debt equity ratio so here 1 lakh divided by 3 lakh 1 is to 3 or 0 0.33 1 lakh divided by 3 lakh you will get uh, 0 0.33 or you can write in the ratio that is 1 is to 3 this is debt equity ratio and they also ask you to calculate proprietary ratio if you want to calculate proprietary ratio the information we require is total shareholders fund and total assets total shareholders fund we have already calculated that is equity share capital plus preference share capital plus general reserve plus profit and loss account balance it will be equal to 3 lakh rupees and we require total asset value in the sense total fixed asset plus total current asset it is 5 lakh so proprietary ratio is equal to shareholders fund divided by total assets shareholders fund we have already calculated that is 3 lakh rupees 3 lakh divided by total asset is given is 5 lakh 3 lakh by 5 lakh it will be equal to 3 is to 5 or 60 percent 3 lakh divided by 5 lakh into 100 you will get 60 percent or you can write in the ratio that is 3 is to 5 so this is about debt equity ratio and proprietary ratio thank you